Hi guys, welcome to Fuck It Why Not, welcome back doll. If you're watching on YouTube, please subscribe, like, leave a comment <laughs> and all that jazz. Um, we have the gorgeous Mildred with us Woo! today. Woo! Thank you so much for coming on. Thank you. How are you? Me. I'm good, how are you? <laughs> yeah, I'm, well, <laughs> I'm the same as I was two minutes ago when we asked each other. <laughs> what was that, 10 minutes yeah. ago? Oh, um, thanks for coming on. I know you don't normally do podcasts. I actually don't. They make me feel really nervous. Really? Yeah, because I don't know what we're going to talk about and I'm like exposing Ooh. myself. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. You say you went on the <laughs> violin for probably what's going to happen today, so <laughs> fuck it, why not? Hey! Hey! <laughs> That's what we like. Exactly. Indeed. Yeah. So what have you been up to? How's life going for you right now? Life. I've just moved in with Chloe. Yeah. 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 yeah that's Who's what's that? going on. Dream team. Who's that? I'm off. <laughs> <laughs> Chloe Lee. Burrows. Who's Chloe Burrows over here. <laughs> She's come from Royal's Pool. Um, that's a dream team though. I love it. I know. So we're enjoying it. I actually thought Chloe was going to be really messy. And I've been pleasantly surprised. <laughs> Good. She's Good. like the proper mum of the house. She gets up in the morning. She makes a cup of tea. She unloads the dishwasher. And then she like washes up anything that's in the sink. And she remembers where the bins are going to be taken out. Like, I feel like what she's babying do? me. What do I do? I don't know. Yeah, what are you up there? to whilst um, this is all happening? I'm just having fun, Most drinking wine. Yeah, yeah, nice. That's what living is about. Yeah, that is it, basically. So. That's good, though. I mean, it's good that you're enjoying living together. Yeah. Because sometimes it don't work. I know. Yeah. Well, that was the thing, with if whether it was going to. But we did live together for... Seven weeks in Love Island. True, true. Right. Actually, yeah. You've, I didn't even think of that. Yeah, that yeah, was like a little that. taster. Yeah. yeah. Mm. So it's all good. It's all good. I mean, it's only been two weeks, so we'll see what I say in <laughs> yeah. a couple of months. Give it one more. Chloe <laughs> 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 just a lovely slag her off. <laughs> <laughs> what was she cooking the other night? She was cooking a gnocchi uh, chorizo pepper pasta oh avant-garde yeah she's what a really good fuck? cook really? Like, i'm actually i don't cook oh, what do i do again I don't know <laughs> <laughs> she yeah. cooks she cleans anyway yeah she cooked that and it was really really nice i like to make pasta bake in a jar in a jar well like they come <laughs> from the jar oh <laughs> i thought, I thought, you, I thought you were cramming in pasta That's into a I jar to okay go. right there okay <laughs> No, from the jar, put it in like pasta bake dish, said they're banned. Well, yeah, so. who's got time to make the well, That's sauce what from I mean. Scratch. I don't want to stand there. No. I can't cook the same no. life. I'm the fussiest eater. Not? I'm the fussiest eater. Kyron doesn't eat anything. If you name food, I probably won't eat it. Sushi. No. Chicken. Well, yeah, I eat chicken. <laughs> <laughs> I eat chicken. I basically, this is my, what I don't Go eat. Go on. Right? Not one vegetable. They make me physically Bitter. feel ill to my core. That is an it. Yeah. Incredible news. What, really? Um, mm -hmm. You don't eat any that's of it? That's an it. I, w I force myself because I feel like I need to, but I don't enjoy it and I would rather not. Right. I can have it in like a, in a juice if they're juiced. You know what I mean? Oh no! What? Actually, just say if like a bit of lemon well, in like it. A just green, like, like a green, like a green juice. juice. Yeah, I can have that. Really? Yeah, yeah. Sure, that just tastes worse. Isn't I think it? Actually, it's like the it does taste shit, it? doesn't it? Do you just down it? That does taste shit. I actually don't mind it. Oh right. Okay. It's like the texture of vegetables to me just makes me feel physically ill. I, I do agree, only with mushrooms. I hate mushrooms. Yeah. That's the only one I don't no. like. Mm. Magic. Or like, apart from magic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe magic <laughs> mushrooms. <laughs> but yeah, no vegetables, nothing pasta based. That makes you feel ill. You don't like pasta? No, it, you don't feels, like pasta. it feels like slimy, like rubbery Are slime. Are you serious? No, 100%. Oh, right, not, okay. one, not one bit of pasta. But can we just bear in mind rice. though? <laughs> He's right. not tried any of this food in I so have. long. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, literally, so long. he's like going off what he knows as a child. Like, yeah, but I actually, I had jollof rice the other day, and it was actually, I actually enjoyed it. I've but tried with that. rice, try that. right? Do you actually eat it because you enjoy it, or is it just like a plate filler? What? Do you oh, like, like crave like rice? Like fried rice, bang it. Yeah, yeah that's okay, hard. If it's got flavour yeah. to it, I wouldn't yeah. eat plain rice, obviously. Yeah, like. but what about pilau? Is that not plain? Yeah, it's got beer <laughs> flavour in it. <laughs> Pilau's a flavour. Pilau, isn't it? is it? I don't know. I is thought it? that was just the name of a rice grain. I don't know. Yeah, like I no, thought, because it, it's just white rice and this doesn't seem It's to a little anything. bit different, isn't it? Is that the yellow Maybe. one? Is Pilau the no, yellow one? No, Pilau's white. That's white, isn't it? Which is the one that you get and it's um, multicoloured. Oh. From the takeaway. Rainbow the Pilau. It's multicoloured. Do you know which one I mean? No. No. <laughs> Do you know which one I mean? That you get from like an Indian takeaway. I thought I knew what you meant and then I don't know what you meant. Yellow <laughs> Pilau. Like rainbow rice. No, but it's like different colours. Never had it. It's Maybe like that's pink, not a yellow. flavor. That's like food coloring, babe. I don't think that's a flavor. No, but it like it's, it's a nice First flavor. Time I've heard of it. You should have seen him last night though at that event. So they came around with these. What were they? Mozzarella and like effing had lobster. I know it's called burger and lobster, but 
Yeah, you guys, we piece. went to a bagger and lobster event and they were shocked that there was so much lobster. No, but <laughs> it was I, wasn't, like, I wasn't shocked. I no, knew that I was, was coming. I was like, right, calm down with it. Where's the burgers? It was just lobster. Anyway, oh, yeah. so mozzarella and they were like this big. Kyron literally sat there for ages just licking the tip to see if he'd like it. It was like this. Oh. That's why I take little nibbles because if I put that all in my mouth and I don't like it, what do I do with it? If I spit it out, just that's like, oh, the thought of like feeling the food come out. Oh. So I can't swallow it then. I can't then. swallow it because then it feels weird going down the throat. So it just stays in my mouth like uh, a little mouldy little. I think we should do eating <laughs> challenges on here. Yeah. Yeah. We need we to get a food therapist on it. <laughs> no, we should do eating challenges. That'd be so funny with you. Yeah, well. Oh I'd, my God, we should do that thing like where I'm you get celebrity. blindfolded and no, you have to eat that. stuff and guess what fuck it is. Because that'd be so good. Actually, also, this is disgusting. Coleslaw and beans. They are fucked. I like beans. I, they are fucked. What, like bad. mixed together? The stench of cold beans when you open a fridge. Oh, cold Ooh. beans. Yeah, no oh one eats God. cold beans. Well, I'm sure some people do. Yeah, but. I think my mum eats cold beans. Does and she? who leaves yeah. beans in the fridge? Oh, my what God. Yeah, well, because you don't want to use a whole tin. Well, not, just... What if you don't want to use the whole tin? Oh, yeah. But cupboard is still quite cold, though. <laughs> <laughs> Like that still counts as cold What, beans? just open yeah. the cupboard and put it back it's in the cupboard? It's not hot, do you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, true, right. okay. Like, it true. would still be cold. Yeah, I suppose so. She would eat it, like, he would sit in the cupboard and I think she would eat it like that. She eats, like, frozen peas and stuff as well. What, frozen? Oh, really? really? They're rock hard, no? Yeah, maybe not. I'm going to break that up. They're a bit crunchy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, she probably I'm gets frozen sure. peas and cooks She likes frozen, frozen peas, and peas. And No, she'll... Just munch on some frozen peas. God, no wonder you don't like vegetables. Your mum was yeah. feeding you frozen peas. No, I at room temperature beans. beans. <laughs> I have a story. When I was younger, growing up, so I, because I hated veg, my dad, he's actually going to kill me if I say this, but he would basically not let me leave the table until I'd eaten the veg on my roast that dinner. That was the same as me. Yeah, but yeah. I would sit there and cry. Mm. And I would literally <laughs> sob over my roast because yeah. I wouldn't eat these carrots. And he is now this thing where I refuse to eat any carrots because I'm actually traumatized mm. from it. Mm. That's, you know what I mean? that's yeah. Is that why you yeah. pass her out of a jar? <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's why I eat pasta every single day. Actually, out I think that's jar. with pasta with me because I used to be a swimmer, right? right. When I was in school. <laughs> No, Kyron actually oh, was. Right? No, seriously, Kyron was I really did. good. Yeah. I used to be a professional swimmer, guys. <laughs> Pro swimmer out here. <laughs> I was. I was really, really good. Did you have to shave your body? <laughs> no, you I, did, I was a child. It was before PB. Oh. What's this got to do I've with not pasta? Hit PB yet. Right, so my dad used to force me to eat pasta because right. it's like a slow releasing energy or yeah. like whatever it is. Yeah. But I used to literally and it eat spit. <laughs> it was plain pasta with salt and some chicken mm. goosh on Skylet, right? <laughs> And he put it in my mouth. Cutting it. And he'd literally hold my face until I'd eat and I'll, <laughs> and <it's> like, <laughs> like literally gagging and crying and snotting, like trying to eat this thing. So that's what uh, it is. Yeah, trauma. You're trauma as well. From yeah. That. That's why you won't eat pasta. But I, I don't know, you. I don't know about all the other foods though. I've got no yeah. trauma <laughs> Actually, I feel like that's true. Like you can actually have so much trauma with food. Like I will never eat a runner bean because one time I choked. No, seriously. <laughs> I what? choked a runner bean. Run bean. I choked on a fucking runner bean, right, right in the back of my throat, and I need like, like physically gasping for air. Couldn't breathe. My parents were literally trying to do that fucking manoeuvre. Oh, me, the to, like, Heimlich. Yeah, the Heimlich yeah, 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 manoeuvre. Yeah. And there's me like trying to fucking get it up, and I just ended up throwing it all up. Uh, <laughs> what, just ended bean? up running just around. Just one. No, but the rest of everything else. Just, like, just I goes never, like <laughs> throwing up the bean. Yeah. <laughs> literally, just, just one whole runner bean comes out. <laughs> Your dad's there going, all right, and you go. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, runner beans is off the table. Okay, yeah, yeah trouble. what's that. your one? Fish. Oh. Fucking hate fish. But last no. night, I was last eating You literally ate all the lobster last night. What the hell? What are you no, bringing it around. <laughs> no, but it wasn't, if it's fishy, I can't, I don't, oh, fishy. If it's fishy, <laughs> oh, fishy. <laughs> I can't bear he it. He was but. literally dribbling at the fucking lobsters you were, in the tank last night. You had, like, you had like a life. lobster hot doggy and it looked really hot fishy. Doggy. You had <laughs> a lobster croquette, whatever it's called. You had lobster. Mozzarella. No, but because yeah, it wasn't mozzarella. fishy. If it's like fishy, fishy, I don't like it. I like Ooh. tuna and like calamari if it's not too fishy, but if it's fishy. What? Yeah, but what have you got a story behind that? Well, I'm not allowed to have stories on here. Oh, fuck okay. Oh, oh, right. They've like, literally been cussing right. out. No. So, and it takes a whole life story. Shall we story, please? No, we're going right. to start listening to Oliver's okay. stories now, right, yeah. guys. Right. And, tell tell us and by the time it's finished, it'll. Tell us a short story about fish. 
I just don't like it. It's horrible. But I was the same. <laughs> my parents would make me sit at the table until yeah. on my own. Mm. But did you oh have like, no. <laughs> no, they'd all leave, they'd leave. I'd be oh, there for a good 45 minutes like gagging because I didn't like fish. Do you not feed it to the dog though? And we didn't have a dog. Oh. <laughs> we do now. Uh, no, I literally gag like I hate fish. Oh. And one time my sister gave me a sweet <laughs> and she was like, oh my God, how this sweet's unreal. So I had it and I, I bit into it. <laughs> about the fish, right? <laughs> no, <laughs> listen! Yeah. I bit into it and it was a cod liver oil tablet. <gasps> Fucking oh. bitch. You bit into a cod? No, cause she told me it was a sweet and I was a greedy little cunt. <laughs> That's, That's, That's awful. awful. And I was literally in the sink going. <sighs> <sighs> cod liver oil. Wait, is there like juice inside? A cod yeah, liver. yeah, so yeah. I, I bit juice. into it and it went fish in my mouth. It's fish, fish oil. Juice. Okay, I can imagine fish that. Fish Have you never room. seen one? Yeah, but I've seen <laughs> I thought like, it'd be like a tablet, it'd be like hard. No, they're a bit squishy. No. So it's got they're like pop. Ju- I thought it was just going to be like you eat, you know, like if you eat like... <laughs> <laughs> Go on, what? Pasta in a jar. <laughs> yeah. Slice I can't think of dice. anything that relates to it. Like, um, I'm, I've got it in my head, but I can't find the word. <laughs> <laughs> she's lost for words in that story. <laughs> Guys, she's lost anyway. for words. But yeah, she made me eat one of those things. Oh. Well... But I just have a phobia of fish. Fish. Apart from last night when I was hungry. Yeah. <laughs> the, the only image every time fish has been said in this, basically just before this, before we started, Millie said she saw a fish. <laughs> 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 Where was she? Millie said she saw poo. a fish. Yeah. And it had a shit. And it was a really long, stringy it fish. Was on it. I'm not joking you about this long. Coming out of his bum. It was an iPhone charger. It was charger. a really small fish. And I, I didn't know what it was. I was like, what the fuck is that? And Ryan was like, that's his poo. And I was like, what? Actually, that's a good point. How that's the only all image I've got in head. When yeah. the poo was longer than the fish. The poo was no, much longer than the fish. Did you notice in Thailand, like, how the water in the toilet is <clears> higher <throat> up so your poos go out longer? I was giving out, like, logs in, in <laughs> Bali. Yeah, no. but just because the water's higher in the toilet doesn't mean I... you're going to have a longer shit. No, it does, because when you're... Right, this is... So it means about plumbing. <laughs> <laughs> Chelmsford plumbing! <laughs> <laughs> also, if you live in Chelmsford, please give my phone back. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I would love it. Sorry, what was you talking about before I just got carried away to my well, poo? Actually, that's a good point. Fish poo. You I just got know. back from Thailand. Oh, yeah. yeah. How was Thailand? I really want to go. It was unreal. I've never been unreal. that far away in my life. Mm. Like, the furthest I've been was this year, was LA. That was like 11 hours on mm. a flight. But this was, we had to get three flights. We were traveling for like a day. Oof. It was really long, but so worth it. It's beautiful out there. And we just had so much fun. Mm. How long were you there for? 11 days. That's a good amount of time. Yeah, yeah. it was just close to me though. So I actually want to go back mm. and see the rest yeah. of Thailand, like Phuket. Yeah. Is it pee pee? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, pee pee. Pee pee is meant to be beautiful. Pee pee. Yeah. I always just quit pee pee. So and then, I. yeah, my sister was like, Millie, it's like, it's pee pee. I was like, okay. <laughs> so, yeah. Pee pee islands. Yeah, Everyone yeah, says really it's so go. nice, don't they? Like, mm. when they go, it's, it's just. It's the beaches. Mm. I just love being on holiday. Same. I love, I was meant to be. I was meant to live in the sun. I wasn't yeah, meant to be same. in this country. I don't want to be in this country. No. I'm so fucking bored shitless of this weather. When are you next going on holiday? Wednesday. Oh, perfect. <laughs> 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 what That's a horrible, great. horrible girl. Where are you going? LA. With oh, like, amazing. Yeah, I'm going for like four, three days. Oh, four what days. for? Um, like a Netflix. Um, it's basically just to go for an event. Amazing. Are they yeah. for it? Yeah, yeah. They literally just messaged him on Instagram, like, hi. Do you are you all going? No, I don't know. Right? Right? Come just, fucking go No, in. it's me. I think Netflix it's cancels. me and Maddie are going. <laughs> and oh, I think it. it's Max, Grace and Joe as well. Oh, that's going to be so much fun. Yeah, it should be good. Yeah, that <gasps> would be fun. I'm excited for it. LA is amazing. There. Like, it's like, I don't, I just feel like it's like the movies. Mm. You've got to go to, like, the Hollywood sign. Have to. Have to. Did you? Yeah. Did you? Got a cab up there, though. Oh, fair. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, is it like really far away when you get there? You'd be like, oh. Well, it depends where you're staying. Do you know where you're staying? No idea. Because we stayed on Sunset Boulevard, which is like a famous street oh in LA. Mm. Yeah. And yeah. then to get to Beverly Hills, like the actual hills, it was about 10 minutes all right. in the cab. Oh, that's all right. And it's like right where all the famous places are. Mm. Like there's this um, uh, Italian restaurant you've got to go to. It's called um, Pasta John and, and Vinny's. <laughs> John and Vinny's. 
remember that. Oh, well, they sell vodka I'm pasta. You don't like pasta? Down. It's don't. literally irrelevant for you. Do they do pizza? Yeah. Perfect. Did you go to Lisa Vanderpump's restaurants? That's no, the only reason why I'd want to go to one and see. I went to go see, you know, Sunset, Selling Sunset. Oh, did yeah. you? They're a thing. Did you actually see it? No, it was closed. Oh. <laughs> Every I day would... that I was there. So oh. I was, like, I was gonna going to say, on? do you reckon they actually work there? Or is it just no. a show? Well, they have a full on shop. Like, you can see the setup, but like, I was there for five days and not one of the days it was open. Oh, because yeah. they don't need to bloody work. They're all fucking minted. Yeah. The amount yes. of commission they make off those houses. Mental. Well, Stop. the commission is actually, they don't make that commission. I think the company makes that commission and then they get a small percentage of that. So they don't actually earn like 350k oh, from what, what they want to sell. Wow. Their own, like, split, they what? They still make rubbish. Yeah, well, they, they yeah, still I mean, make money. Still a lot of money, but but they. Do you know when it says the commission? This is great. And it says like 400k, <laughs> but they don't get the 400k. They only get a percentage of it. Oh my god. That's I mean, you literally of... wouldn't do that job anymore if you could sell like 10 houses and then. You're like, I've got a million or yeah. more. So why would you work? Literally. Honest. Actually, oh. I don't know. You probably would. But Sell a single flow. They're single also glam. House. Also, another little thing about selling sunsets. Apparently, when they film it, right, the houses that you see are houses they've sold, but not. they're not actually necessarily selling them at that In current that moment. moment. Yeah. They oh, have, yeah, they have TV, sold them though. properties, but not necessarily right there and then. You know what I mean? So that the person that owns it's just like, yeah, you can, yeah, you can have it house. for the day, yeah. yeah. Oh my God, I'd love to be able to. Like honestly, that. the houses, when you go there, they are, when oh, they see I want about the sunset. Yeah, what do you, you mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, where is that then? No, that is yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Is that in LA? Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> because I was saying, oh, yeah, they're beautiful. You were like, when you go there, I was like, yeah, they're beautiful. I was like, I've not been there yet. I'm talking about the show. <laughs> well, no, no, but they are, though. They're no, actually but when mental. you go to LA, yeah. if you go to Beverly Hills and you see some of these houses, you just think, oh, my God, like, People would live here. Like, mm. That is incredible. Did you see anyone really famous? No. I just want to see Kylie Jenner. But you know who um, my... So I went with ASOS and Puma and I went out of ASOS. The Puma team went out for dinner somewhere else mm. and they saw Leonardo DiCaprio. <gasps> what? And I was Unreal. like, why did I not go out for dinner with them instead? Uh-oh. So missed him. And they saw someone else really famous and I literally can't remember. I have the world's worst memory. But I was really hoping I'd see Justin Bieber because we went to his famous <laughs> restaurant in LA. Really? And he wasn't there. Fuming. I know. Imagine what about Hayley? Do you like Hayley? I love Hayley. I love, Hayley. Hayley. We love them both. They're literally a couple girls. <laughs> they are good. They are. They, they yeah. are. I love them so much. Literally yeah. was literally a crazy fan. Are you a believer? Oh, every day. No, but yeah, I, I stalked I him them. all the time. You what? Stalked him. Did, Did you? you? Have yeah, you got any anytime I was in on? London. But this was when I was like teens. And I would literally, I remember I took a day off school to go to GMTV. Remember GMTV? Yeah. Good morning. What's that? Was, Is that good morning? Good morning TV. <laughs> <laughs> good morning TV. <laughs> Wait, who? I swear it's Lorraine Kelly, isn't it? I don't, it's obviously not, it's not on now. It's, it's changed to something, but oh. back then it was called GMTV. Okay. And we, I found out he was there and I took the day off school and then I ended up being on telly because... <gasps> They were filming all the crowds outside who was waiting for him, me being one of them. And then all my school teachers found me, probably about 13. See, you were destined to be on TV. You need to get that. That's that's where it all began. That's where it all began. That's where your TV career started. That's where you got scouted. (laughs) 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 They've been waiting. (laughs) That girl. Yeah, we want her. Yeah. Exactly. So, obviously, you were the winner. You won Love Island. Of Love Island. <laughs> how was it? Like, how was the whole experience for you? Oh, shit. And yeah. a bit. It was amazing. Honestly, experience of a lifetime. Yeah. And I wouldn't change anything for the world. Good. Like, it was... I don't know. I've never really had... I know we were just joking about me being on TV, but I've never had the thing where I've wanted to be on TV. Mm. I split up with my ex and I was single for about a year and a half and my friend sent it to me and was like... It was a Facebook ad. She was like, Millie, please like apply for this as we fucking jokes and i was like yeah <laughs> oh come on there like what why not what have i got to lose and i was like oh and they need a 60 second video what should i do and i was like why don't you just send them like loads of videos of you like really drunk doing stupid shit and i was like yeah all right then let's do that really so literally just like a comp what is it like a compilation, yeah, a compilation of like me doing like i'm not gonna tell you what i said <laughs> <laughs> me doing Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Go on, what you, what, what? So you said you sent a compilation of me doing stupid shit when right. I'm drunk, 
and then <laughs> have you they... still got this video because i would love to see it i so annoying so it was 60 seconds the f first 30 seconds i had to speak about why i would be a good islander yeah i have that part but i don't have the com the final oh. video and i've asked my friends for it because i put it oh maybe no i don't i definitely don't i'll try have to try and find it but um yeah one thing led to another they got back to me and wanted a zoom call then i got on this zoom call and we we're just having a chat with this girl like it just was so chill and then yeah it just this was oh, in november when you, when you did that zoom call like when you were doing like the interview with him we, did you start to feel like oh god like this actually might be a thing then like i don't know i never really believed it that it yeah. would be like mm. because it was like oh that was a zoom call nothing's gonna come of it like this is so mm. stupid weird like it's not gonna happen mm. didn't think i'd ever get a call back and then it kept getting to the next stage and i was like to my friends this is really weird. They keep wanting to call me back mm. and they wanted more chats and now they're wanting doctor medicals and then they wanted me to meet the execs and I was like, oh my right. God. Is it like a really intimidating thing going through the like the audition process? It's scary. Yeah. Well, it, it's not scary because I don't know why I just said that. I just lied. <laughs> it's not scary. It's actually really chill. <laughs> Chloe's rubbing off on me. <laughs> um, no, it's really chill. It's like you well, she just... lied and she went, I'm, I just lied, so no. <laughs> <laughs> You're rubbing off on me. Guys, Chloe is here, by the way. We're not yeah. just talking to her, guys. <laughs> um, no, it's like they just want to have a chit chat with you and just mm. find out about you, your life. Like, it's not it's not intimidating. Oh, when you get to the end and you meet the execs, and you're like, right, this is, this is the big moment because they make the final decision. Mm. Um, but they were really nice as well. And the chat was just like really natural. And, and they always say though, like even you get to this point, it doesn't mean you're going to go on it. And they rang and said, we want you to go on there and <gasps> we want you to fly out on this day. But it doesn't mean you could still quarantine. Doesn't mean you're going to go on it. So the whole time I'm thinking this could just end any moment. Like, oh. Really? So you yeah. could do the whole quarantine thing People and they just say- People quarantined and not gone on. Wait. Yeah. But they, they know like that they're going in there. Like they know that. They make that very, Clear so do they then <laughs> when everyone's there do they just make the decisions on like okay well we think we should just chuck this yeah. person in now yeah and they just do it like off the bat there and then yeah because they basically said to me oh my God, they I didn't did know say that. to me oh we want you to be an early bombshell so they knew that they wanted me to put me in within the first few weeks but mm. they said it's basically based on reaction and whatever happens because it's like they're watching it live yeah. and obviously when we see it two Got days you. later oh. but they want they'll put me in when they think that it's right for yeah. me to go in so yeah, they're just yeah. watching it all unfold and be like okay yeah. now it would be an ideal yeah. time to uh, when right. did you actually go in i went in on the seventh day you came oh, in with so lucinda right? came in with lucinda yeah, yeah. oh my god yeah mm. this is a weird question but they did make you do it do they make you do an STD test before you go in? Yeah. Yeah, I was going to say. Do they? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I suppose because like, people get a bit jiggy. <laughs> oh Chloe <my> failed. <laughs> Could you imagine? Well, what would happen if you did fail? They'd be like, oh, you can't go in then. No, you just well, get the treatment, no. You can't have, like, you just get an injection in your body. Well, no, they, do, they surely would, that would hold well, you from going Well, if you had chlamydia, in. you could just, just treat it. Yeah. And they, they, I don't think they, yeah, they think really liked that. you. They wouldn't be like, oh, you and me now are not going in. Yeah. Mm. So they'd probably just give you some. Because mm. when I went to the doctors, he was like, oh, um, what? He was like, anything you want to ask me? And at this point, I had really bad acne. And I knew I was going, well, at this point, I was like, it's coming to it. And I was like, mm. I had the implant in my arm, which gave me really bad uh. acne. And I was waiting on the NHS for like 12 weeks mm -hmm. and hadn't got it. And I was like, um, I don't think I want to go on TV if I've got really bad skin. I'm waiting to get out. And he was like, we'll help you. He was like, normally I would charge like three, four hundred pounds. But because we're like working with Love Island, we'll do it for you for a hundred pounds and we'll get it out for you this week. Like come back. Oh wow. And they like really helped me. Did you, fi did you find that that helped when you took it out then? Because obviously yeah. the implant's hormonal, isn't it? Yeah. So. Oh my God, like literally cleared up straight away. It's but huge then... as well, isn't it? Like you can literally see it in your Yeah, arm. you can feel it. It's like a big like mm -hmm. line here. And I I'm just r such a forgetful person. So I wanted to have something that was more well, it's like safe. Yeah, basically. Like, but you're not going to miss it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then it, that's when six months later, that's when my acne came. And then I, but then I was going through all the Love Island stuff and I was like, oh my God, like, I just can't go on TV mm. like this because oh. I was so self-conscious. 
um, and all the video, all the calls of them were over Zoom, so they couldn't really see. Got you. I had you. makeup on, I didn't mm. see I had acne. I thought, if they see, I do. Were you worried about that? Did I you was. think that was something really worried about it? Mm. Mm. Oh, that's horrible. Yeah, I was. And I, now it annoys me because I think, oh, so what? Like, I mean, I don't know whether they would have wanted me if I did have full on acne, but. Um, by that point, I still had a couple of spots. They didn't care, but mm. I was really self-conscious about it on yeah. the show. Like, yeah, oh, what if I be. break out mm. and like I get called spotty mm. and like it was something that was constantly on my mind. But luckily, I had the implant out. It cleared up. I was having my Canadian sessions, and I was in the sun. And when you're in the sun, your That's skin dries true. up. Yeah. That's so you didn't true. Have any spots? Yeah, well, when I you're in the sun, your skin is unreal. That is so true. I because mm. I I suffer with my skin sometimes. Like Do I go you, through yeah. really weird periods of like flaring up, and like all of a sudden, I've just got like loads of spots, and it, it, mm. it does knock your confidence. Like, yeah. I must admit, out of everything, like I think that for me is the worst thing. Yeah, I find myself so like insecure when I've got loads of spots. Oh, no. Don't know why. I it's know it's annoying. I, I know. feel like I wish I didn't feel yeah, like that. Yeah, like it's normal, obviously. It's, it's so, so normal. normal. But for me, that is the most difficult thing for me to deal with. Mm. And it's like, oh shit. And like, you know, when you try like every product under the sun and nothing it seems works. to work. No. And obviously like try different diet things and try different like, yeah. all these fucking things. But it's really tough to deal with. It yeah. actually is. But the sun... The sun, the sun helps. The well, sun helps. I went and to see a proper. Well, she's. I call her my dermatologist, but she says so I shouldn't call her that. It's like a skin anesthetician or something like that. I mm. can't really pronounce it. And um, she's like, the sun's really bad for you, and I it thickens your skin. And I don't believe it. There's it. a lot of bad things that come. It, like I've heard years that. to come, yeah, but like wrinkles, skin cancer. Yeah. Like I don't it's give not a fuck. Get me in the sun now. <laughs> <laughs> get me to Benidorm. Get me in the sun. Not but, Benidorm. No, it does dry your skin out, and your spots do clear up. Exactly. So it's like a bit yeah. of a. I've got a bit like combination skin. So like yeah. the areas that get spotty are the areas that are oily, mm. and it just clogs up. So I think the sun is good for my skin. Mm. Anyway, but well, if the spots go, spots go. True. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so what did it actually, I'm um, pure like, when you were telling me that story, I was like, oh, I feel like I'm there. What did it actually feel like when you stepped in the villa? Like, were you like, I'm going to shit myself? Because I feel like that's what I feel like. I was so nervous. I get like, even for things like this, like mm. I'm nervous for, I'm like, that's probably why I, I don't really like to put myself in situations like this yeah. or, or bigger. But I don't know what came over me. I was single, I was like, like oh, Millie, you you need to just do something like do something with your life anyway and then it got to it and i just remember feeling so sick and i was like oh. i probably will actually throw up any minute but then i didn't know i was going on with lucinda so i get to the point they're like right you're going in tomorrow um they come and pick me up and then i got to the this like cabins bit where you go before you actually walk in and like lucinda's sitting there and they were like oh is this who you're going in with and i was like Oh, oh, hello. And um, she was like, oh, hi. Nice. And we had like two minutes to talk and introduce ourselves. I was like, right, splitting you up, but you're walking in together in 10 minutes. Get yourselves ready. Might not have been 10 minutes, but a half hour, whatever. And then, um, but she was such a bubbly, confident girl uh -huh. that it really put me to ease. Girl, girl. And I knew that I could walk in with her. And it's like an ongoing thing. Like everyone in the villa, I'd say, like she just took control. And I just sat back and everyone thought I was really quiet, but it was just because I was so nervous. Yeah. I'm not really a quiet person, but in those situations, yeah. I was. And Lucinda was just an angel. Like, well, I think that's it's why a lot I'm of bonded. pressure, isn't it? Mm. Like to just walk in to a load of new people you've never oh. met surrounded by cameras like that's that's a lot it's a lot it? <laughs> and obviously not being on tv before or either mm. and not really knowing well actually we know that you have been on tv yeah now. gmtv yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Millie is sponsored by GMTV <laughs> <laughs> from the age of 13. That was your first deal when you came She's out. real yeah. <laughs> yeah. That was actually the first thing that I did. Good morning. Is After it? Love Island. Full circle. Full circle. Full That's circle. mental. Oh. Was Justin I, Bieber on that episode? No. 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 Unfortunately. Unfortunately. I haven't met him since. Are you glad you did it though? Yeah, really yeah. glad. Yeah. It was the best thing I've ever done. Really? You're still friends with Lucinda as well? Yeah. Yeah, yeah really, really good friends. It's yeah. all just like Three little besties. Yeah. Mm. I think your season was probably the best. Don't lie. No, I'm actually no, You're saying it. I no. think my favourite, my two favourite seasons is the one that Wes was on mm -hmm. and your one. Yeah. They're the, they're the two top for me. Yeah. Really? Yeah. And I that, feel like our season's known for being quite unpopular. Really? Really? Mm. really? I, I think don't... I just 
resonated more with the characters on that on that yeah. season. You know what I mean? Do you? Me yeah, too. like you guys were so relatable, yeah. like to watch. You know what I mean? More 100%. than like nice. on previous seasons. Have been like, well, I don't. Yeah, it's good to watch, but I'm like, oh, I don't. Really yeah, you know when it gets a bit like you don't relate to anyone. You don't actually like <laughs> root for anyone. But I feel like mm. when we were watching like your season and. <laughs> Maura's season, I fucking love Maura. Oh, yeah. like, Maura. That I just, season. When I root for people. That was I, don't, I didn't think I watched Kem season. That was a good season. That was, that was a really good season. Live yeah. That was a good one. And then mm. You know Maura's. that season was the most aired show on ITV? Like that, their first episode was the most like viewers they've ever had on ITV. What one? Um, the first episode of <clears throat> that season with Maura was like millions and millions of people like watched that first episode. Like it like broke records or something like that. Shut up. I know, how weird is that? So that's probably why everyone says that's the best one because that probably is the one that everyone watched. It was mm. good. I and mm. secondly, the most aired was GMTV when you were 30. <laughs> 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 At the front like, please just impick me. <laughs> <laughs> one of my favorite moments is when you were in the talent show. Oh, oh. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and you done a piano, so I actually downloaded the piano Shut app. <laughs> yeah. And can you do us a little demo? Can you do us a rendition, <laughs> Millie, please? Can you do us? I'll, I'll play a song after as well. I mean, I have no idea what to play, but play the greatest little ball when you just know what to do. Yeah. yeah. Like, you know, I, had an, I had a cheat app when I was on the show. You had a what? Like, what? it was an, I had a phone and an app, and it told me what keys to press to this what song. What song did you play? Because I mean, we listened. by Ed Sheeran. <laughs> <laughs> but you actually knew what keys to press. No, I didn't know. It was telling me. How though? Because I can't play the piano. <laughs> so when they said, song? Have you got no, a talent? Really? You literally said, No, but I'll oh, just actually, play I the piano. Um, jingle bells. Okay. I think I did. There we go, guys. Okay. Wait, put it near the mic. <laughs> I did that so wrong, I just made up. Jingle bells. Oh, that was not a jingle, jingle bell. <laughs> 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 okay, I'll try it? and play Stenders. Oh, okay. Yeah, but Karen can actually. It literally just go up in a line. <laughs> <laughs> that was shit. That's pretty good. That's better it's than me. It's not bad. It's like, definitely the wrong note. Yeah. I mean, I can, I, can, I can actually play Mr. Bean. You know Mr. Bean featuring Hold I'm, on a minute. Where is yeah. all this coming from? <laughs> you really? been practicing that. Yeah. Like fucking Adele. Go easy on me. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Let me start again. Let me start again. Okay, go again. That. Why are so close? <laughs> <laughs> well, wow, that was good, right? Well, clap yourself. Doesn't make me laugh so much. <laughs> wow. No, well done. I don't remember I that, that being that the theme school. tune. And you remember? I remember. Wow. I used to be able to play SpongeBob, but I can't remember. I used to be able to yeah. play Chopsticks, if you know Chopsticks. Yes. You used to what? Be able to play Chopsticks. What do you mean play Chopsticks? Like the song Chopsticks. Don't know that song. How's it go again? I can't remember. Okay, that's why I said right, used next. to be able to play. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's up, next? I used to play it myself. Oh, actually, so you played the piano. Oh. Um, yeah. Yeah. But then, did you go in there being like, okay, I'm going to play the piano? No. Did they say, oh, you're playing the piano? By so the way? I'll tell you the story. I basically was having a private chat with Liam, and I'm pretty sure it was on a down day when, when you know you're not being filmed, yeah. but you have cameras that are mics on you still anyway. And we were joking about playing instruments. And I said, yeah, I'm grade two in piano, which I am. <laughs> <laughs> right. But when I was 10. Right. Okay? Okay, so okay. Liam didn't know that. And I was yeah, just yeah. like, right, I'm going to tell you that I'm quite good at piano just because I was just trying to impress him. Well, how many grades are there? Up that. How many grades are there? <laughs> like six or seven. Okay. Is grade two like, grade, is grade one like the grade best? Grade two, mate. No, grade seven would be the best. Oh, so grade two. I think I'm making shit, that up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, grade two. Beginner. Is beginner. You've learned how to open up the piano by now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so, I could play like like nursery rhymes. That's what I could do. Right. Um, but I went for exam and everything for it. Really? Um, I've got a certificate. <laughs> the lot. I need to. We need to see it. We need to see it. <laughs> So anyway, we're talking about that. And then this was like within the first few weeks. And then they basically pull you to one side and say the talent show is coming up. 
this is what we either think you should do or want you to do. And that... <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. It's all right. It's all right. It's um, and they said, we want you to play the piano. And I was like, well, That's I can't so play the piano, so I don't know what you want me to do. And they were like, no, like you said, you were great too. Like, we've already ordered in the keyboard. Oh, so you had no choice then? Yeah, like, like, yeah I had no right. choice. And I was like, <laughs> okay, well, if I get a couple of hours practice and like this app not a couple of hours. Hours. Not, use, not you yeah. sat away I'm in love with the shape somewhere of you I was. Practicing. I was in the diary room on my just own just an echo of a piano in the distance <laughs> <laughs> the organ player in the corner <laughs> <laughs> no do you know when the people go into that room and then have that um, yeah. one to one with the beach art yeah. I bet they said go to the beach art you can practice there in private and I was like thank you <laughs> playing that anyway I'm playing in there for about 45 minutes trying to practice and then all of a sudden the guy who speaks behind the beach are very good midi <laughs> really <laughs> oh Just, you're getting really good at this now and oh. i was like because i was like remembering it and like getting better but then when i actually performed i did some crap were you shitting yourself <laughs> it was shitting iconic. really yeah when you do challenges that do you think oh my god what are people at home gonna say like what are they saying at home yeah, I actually don't i don't know about other people but you're so wrapped up in in there I was more embarrassed about what all the, the rest of them were going to say, like okay. the people watching right. me in yeah, the villa yeah, yeah, rather yeah. than anyone at home. Like I just didn't even think. And um, <laughs> and everyone was like, no, it was really cute. Oh, like, it was. I was like, it was cute because like, it literally song. was just you on your own in front of everyone. Just like. In this long maxi <laughs> pink dress. <laughs> 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 Piano wear. With my heels on, with this little stand-up key. Oh, that is so good, though. And, um, that is brilliant. Yeah, and then I remember when I left, um, the producers was like, we were filming some bit for After Sun. They was like, we've got to show you some of the famous memes that we've had this series. And I was like, oh, yeah, that'd be so fun. Like, not thinking that I was going to be in any of them. And they're showing me ones of Chloe, showing me ones of, like, Lucinda, whoever it was. And then I'm like, I have to react to it. Like, it's all natural, whatever. And then the last ones... There's about 10 of them, of me, <laughs> placed oh. on all everyone's dates, playing the piano. And I just was like, I am mortified. <laughs> Did you I'm not expect that then? No. I was like, I can't believe everyone's been taking the piece on <laughs> <laughs> Guys, Millie's grade two in piano. She's like, grade she's two. real tall. Two, grade two more grades than I am, so. Literally. Yeah, so much. Though. What was you your talent? What did you do? Blow jobs and quick maths. <laughs> you were going to give head. Oh, we were going to do a gymnastics routine together. Oh, that would have been so funny. Yeah, really I know. Funny. But they were like, no, you need to do that. <laughs> yeah, because it was swearing. Right. Swearing? People do guns. swear. Don't go hand in hand. <laughs> oh. oh yeah, because I was I had guns on my heart rate challenge and they glued them to my outfit so I couldn't actually pull the gun out. Oh. Why? Not you. Well, because if she's waving a gun around. <laughs> yeah. Well <laughs> Well, it that, weren't a real loaded gun. No, no but yeah. Yeah. that challenge yeah. Yeah. Pulling that challenge out is my favourite. With the dance challenge. The, the, the heart rate challenge. Oh, that is fun. my favourite out of all of is them. Is the music really loud or is it like on a little stereo in the background? No, it's so? loud. Okay. Well, Alexa, yeah, we, play we horny spoke music. To, we horny spoke to Liberty mm. the oh, other day. Oh, yeah, I saw. And she was saying that, like, you do it all dead sober. Well, most of the time, most of the challenges are deadly sober. They probably give you, like, one drink for, like, that challenge, but... That is awful. I'm not even I that. I'd have, to be, I'd have to be fucking three sheets to the skill. wind. I would have just downed it. Yeah, we, me, it was me, Chloe, and Mary, and all I remember is we had two glasses of wine upstairs in the dressing room, and we were like, right, the way to get drunk is let's just down this quickly. So we downed it, and then we were all practicing on each other. <laughs> 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 so I was like, Chloe, sit down. Does this look good? <laughs> and I did, and she was like, right, let my, let me try. I would See, I wish they myself. showed more stuff like that. I like, know, yeah, the best funny. really funny. That is funny. That's, the, that's the one thing that got me off Love Island because it's like obviously they tell you to literally have the same chats every season yeah. and it makes you guys look really like your life is obsessed around boys. Exactly. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. But you're actually quite a laugh. 
<laughs> I know. Pasta in a the jar. Thank so, you. I suppose is what it's an hour, isn't it? Well, less than an hour, really. If you think forty-five about minutes. Yeah. 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 They should so, do like a BT's episode. They've got to cram yeah. everything in that, which I get, but then it's like it needs to be Love Island drama shit, not yeah. like oh, I'll get to know the cast. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's, that, that's what the Saturdays for though. You know, the, like the fun they do the fun. I love one. the Saturdays. Mm, that's the best ones. Mm. I think it's changed a lot. It has changed it? a lot. It's changed a lot, and, and it's changed for the, it's changed for the better. better yeah. But you know, when you watch a TV program and you think you want some juice, you it's, want it's it. not even like you you're do. tearing someone down. You're it, addressing what they've done on the show. Yeah. you know what I mean. So yeah. it's not necessarily like you're making stuff up to tear them down because they've already done it. Right, so we're about to play the Sprite Challenge, but we've got 7 Up. <laughs> we're right. playing the 7 Up Look, Challenge. Listen, guys, and it's free of sugar, because the sugar tax is through perfect. the roof. We tried our it best to source it. pound in Tesco. <laughs> We tried to. Yeah, we no, tried our best. Easy. Look, we, we we're working what we've got. So it's seven up for now. But just <laughs> imagine it's Sprite. Are we doing it all at the same time? Obviously. Here we we'll do it all at the same time. Oh, God, I'm a bit scared because. I'm Wait, a, does everyone right. know the rules? Yeah. Yes, you, yeah, can't you can't burp. burp. Right. So if you burp, yeah, then you're out. I can't God, make myself I don't burp. To do that. Yeah, neither do I. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna be quite hard though. God. But as soon as I drink an ounce of fizz, my. Oh, really? An ounce is quite I feel a lot. I need though. to get it out. Oh, no, already. Is, don't be sick on me. No, I won't be sick. I'm gonna just deep Why does it make you throw up? It, can, it gave me. I've done this <laughs> once already. Sorry, but I'm quite good at it. And what happened? And it makes you have a really bad stomach pain. No, it really oh, hurts. Great. Like a really bad <laughs> stomach no, really pain because you, it's all the gas and you need. For how to long? Let, well, until, until you burp, you burp. and then oh, when you burp, okay. it's really gone. for like ages. Right. I'm gonna burp instantly. Yeah. How many burps do it wrong and just shit? No, no. <laughs> no burps. Not one burp. No, just one burp, you're out. One burp, you're out. Yeah. But you still have to finish the challenge. No, if you burp, you're out. No, so yeah, if you I'm gonna be out then... instantly. Okay, keep oh, doing right, okay, it. Oh, okay, yeah, whatever. Right, so. Right, ready? ready? Let's go. Cheers. God, I'm Cheers. so scared. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, you guys pure down in it. Fuck that. I've yeah. literally took like a fucking... Look how much... It, that is oh, ridiculous. No, you have to breathe. <laughs> and maybe swallow. <laughs> breathe and swallow, I think, is the trick. I'm good at swallowing. I normally gag and swallow, but I can't <laughs> breathe. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're going to make me work from laughing. Oh, don't, I can guys. feel I'm it getting, already in my throat. Like oh, it's here. Hot. It's here. That's what I mean, breathe it it's down. Here. It's here. It's <laughs> here. Push it down. Ding dong. Oh, sing, I sing, sing that song. Guys, I'm why are you taking this moldy sip there, Mark? Whatever, it's more fucking full than when you started. Are you allowed to speak? Yeah, you can speak. Are you burping internally? No, I'm not. I promise, I'm not. I promise. <laughs> you better, Callum, put the headphones I'm on. I'm just thinking of Amanda Holden Make doing sure this I'm in not Callum's burping. fantasies about Amanda. Amanda. Oi, Millie, you're so good at this. What the hell? This should have been your challenge. <laughs> Fuck the grade two piano. This should have been. Yeah, your challenge. yeah. This Down is a talent. Right this is a talent. No, because you can feel it coming. It's hard to down. <laughs> it's not an enjoyable drink. I'm not enjoying this, guys. I'm actually... <laughs> you know what I mean? The stomach pain. I'm or feeling, it's a throat pain I'm as well. I'm anxious about this. <laughs> I'm actually... I'm, I feel really nervous. <laughs> I'm, I'm no, feeling mine is really brewing. nervous. Yeah. Oh, my heart is pounding. <laughs> what, because you don't want to lose? <laughs> I'm sweating. I'm actually sweating. I'm <laughs> scared. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I keep drinking, but nothing's going down. <laughs> this is, you just burped. <laughs> no, I fucking didn't. <laughs> I heard that. I can feel it. I just, all I want to do no, is shit. I, I literally want to burp. <laughs> Stop, it's my love. It's going to pop. I want to burp my gangrene teeth all over this <laughs> fucking mic. <laughs> Don't make me laugh because I will fucking burp. When you Ooh. have a break, it's all right because it digests. Is it? There's not a real competition for down it. Oh. No, you don't. Sorry, do Chloe. You? Right, you heard it. You heard it. The voice okay. of God has spoken. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck I'm me! I'm my jeans to let my Ow. Room, but... Sam, get that Ow! Right, we're at the same point. I, I, I really need a poo. <laughs> oh my God, I can't. <laughs> I think I'd be sick. Mm. I might have to tap out. Mmm. <laughs> Oh, Oliver's doing good. Really, you're fucking mm. savage. Oh, I feel like really nervous. Mm -mm. Oh my God, how have you done that? I've got really bad stomach pains. I'm feeling sick. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, fuck, that hurts. Oh yeah, I'm feeling bad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
No. <laughs> oh, oh, that felt unreal. <laughs> 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 right, hold on. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. I feel like Bella Hedy is my name. Ow, my stomach is literally, look, <clears throat> exploding. Guys, out, of my, out of my dreams. I'm actually getting I feel you. ill. Chloe, thank you for that advice because now I feel great. I might have to burp, you know. Because oh my God. No, guys. <laughs> You've only had a little bit. I can't. I thought I was going to fucking throw up. <laughs> 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 Nearly starts queefing. <laughs> so the smell of my own burp, they made me gag. <laughs> Even letting it, it's just growling out Cuddling. of the throat. Oh, what, my Are God. You Come on, down it there, yeah. <laughs> that is making me want to throw up. Uh, like, this is... <laughs> Wait, no one's drunk that whole bottle I yet. I can't. I've got. My yeah, stomach yeah. can't cope in whatever it is. Come on, Projectile vomit. Oh, my God. <laughs> yes. Congrats, guys. You're not doing that. I can't. Love Island exclusive. Millie Court throws up every. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stop now. I feel really ill. This is getting grotesque. Oh. Feel how sweaty my palms are. What? It's like a reaction to thunder. That, that girl. Oh, it's so sucky. It's my windpipe. Windy. It's my windpipe. <laughs> Oh, no, I have to undo them again. I That's do like, tight. I do like have them. Have you burped yet? <sighs> no, I have. Oh, right. Go on, I, no, I feel like you should let it out. You've opened your trousers now, come on. I don't think, Chloe, I don't think you understand, I mate. I have to just do that for a No, bit. you have to down it, you're all hurt, but do it. <laughs> well, I've My lost the competition. I've lost it. What is going on? Go on Mine's not It'll just hurt the bottom of your belly. No, it's oh. not. I'm going to fucking physically throw it up. <laughs> do it then, it's for the podcast. Fuck it, why not? That would be good. What, you think that's good content? Yeah, make yourself see it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You might get on GMTV. If you could feel my palms, they are sweaty. It's come on. <laughs> oh, that is wet. That's giving me like an intense reaction. Yeah, I'm just sitting here with my belly out. I'm going to sit that up. Let's have a it's breather. Let's just take all our clothes Let's do some ASMR <laughs> just to chill us. Oh my. <laughs> oh, no, I, think, I think I just swallowed a tonsil. Oh my. I think I just Giddy absolutely eye. downed my tonsil. <laughs> <laughs> right, Sam, finish yours off. How much oh, have you got? I'll left? finish you off. This whole area of the room now just Please. stinks. <laughs> I'll seven up. I'll seven up. Go, go, go. Yeah, baby. You're running for the LGBT. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is so rough. Oh, fishy. <laughs> <laughs> fish poo, fish poo. Oh, fucking fishy. Fish poo. Oh, fish massive poo. stringy fish poo, poo. Pets at home. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh wait, why am I literally having such a physical reaction? I'm literally snotting. Maybe I'm literally you're allergic. sweating. <laughs> Get the epi pen out. Yeah. God, fuck anyone that can do that in one go, I applaud you. I don't know how. Fuck you me. It? What's going on, oh. guys? Who even started Kyle this would challenge? never applaud me. I am. Amanda Holden started it. <laughs> I might have to call 111. I feel fucking weird. <laughs> no, have you seen her do it, though? Amanda <laughs> Holden? Yeah. Yeah, and she literally like spits at the camera. She goes, <laughs> have you, Wait, have you seen that? <laughs> have you seen that video of Amanda Holden when she goes, Hi. Yeah. I'm wearing a lovely yellow dress yeah. out in the alcove of Portugal. <laughs> the sun is shining. Uh, Wine. Is oh, fuck. Uh, the grapes are growing. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the podcast, Chloe Burrows. Yeah. This is how you get your money back. All right, let's right, see let's it. Go. Honestly, I'm going to record it, it, it but my phone's in transfer. I've done it before. Right. Really? Me and Bridie didn't, I honestly, the demon took over me. Right, no, go. 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 No, all right. Anytime today. We need silence. Silence in the studio. All right. Oh, no. that, is that was all right. That... Oh, no. 
Do you regret it now? <laughs> Brave and swallow. Brave and swallow. You can't. That's or not, just gag and swallow. Download it. Right, well, you download it. Illegal DVDs. Pirate copy. <laughs> <laughs> What was that advert? Fuck you you wouldn't you steal a car. Yeah. <laughs> you wouldn't steal a handbag, so why would you steal a movie? <laughs> no, I don't deal, 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 deal. Right. Get my straight. Right, come on. Chloe, 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 show me how it's done. <laughs> that sounded like a blow up bed going nice. down. <laughs> I told you the runny nose is real. Look how much you've downed. I know, it's low. <laughs> you've literally done a yeah. shot. Guys, I was recording for five minutes. How long have I been there? Four and a half. <laughs> no, one minute so far. You can do it. <laughs> <laughs> no, you've got to keep going. Right, you've keep got going. to finish it. <laughs> Your shit. Got further than that. But that's how you do the challenge. We did that's it like that. We did. We did. <laughs> Sat there back there. Sam, <laughs> you know, this is how you do it. You're all like sipping and babysitting. You've got, it, you've got runny it. nose. No, look, listen. I didn't do the <laughs> challenge. Runny. Though, right? Don't look at me. I won. Yeah, you actually did. By the way. Yeah, right. you won. I came second. I came last, I and I don't care. I just. <laughs> <laughs> We are keeping that in. Look at this laugh of you, mate. <laughs> <laughs> that weave. <laughs> well, do you know what? There we go. There we go. <laughs> hey, listen to this laugh. Listen to Millie's laugh. <laughs> <laughs> That's literally me Why after the Sprite there? challenge trying to get the air back in my body after fucking <laughs> bubbling up inside. Oh, oh, that was really Ooh. funny. Well, that was good. I enjoyed that. Yeah. Not really, but... <laughs> <laughs> that was really painful. That made I me a bit hot yeah. under the collar. Bad stomach ache. <laughs> my, nah. nose bad. Nah. my nose was running. My palms are sweaty. <laughs> Arms are heavy. Mom, spaghetti. <laughs> oh, I hate spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I fucking, I'm, pe I'm pesperating. <laughs> Wait, pe pesperating. <laughs> I'm a pesticide. <laughs> <laughs> what does perspirating even mean? Sweating. <laughs> and that's that. Thank you so much for watching, guys. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey. <laughs> Shitting. That's <laughs> oh, Central C yeah. is hot. Do you think he's just done a thing with Jackamere's? Yeah. Has he? He mm, has. Looks fit in that. Mm -hmm. He look, his one. skin is oh, unreal. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I must say he is very good looking. He's very fucking good looking. Really? Smash or pass Central C. Yeah. Smash, smash, smash. 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 <laughs> Millie, smash or Mega pass. Mega smash. Fast. Smash. Smash. Yeah. Smash. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. He Absolutely. is incredible. He's actually older than all of us. What? No, not me. <laughs> How old is Central C? Oh, never this again. Yes, it took two 24 hours. 24 is the same age as me. Oh. Oh, wait. Yeah, he's older. Older than all of he's us. He's older than me. How old are you? I'm 20. Jesus Christ. <laughs> not, he's 23. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine if I was 20? No, I'm 23. 23. Oliver, what how are you? How can I be homophobic? I'm 23. Well, how old are you? <laughs> 24. Excellent. No. So, right, Central C, get on the podcast, babes. Love you. Oh. <laughs> 23. Four. I'm 25 in February. <gasps> I'm 26 in 10 days or something. Oh, yeah. Mm. Okay, okay, right, we'll go around and we'll talk about fears and phobias. <coughs> yeah. So, okay. what is your biggest fear slash phobia? My biggest fear is dying in an aeroplane crash. That's so specific. <laughs> <laughs> on the way to Love Island, like, not I'm not gonna lie, expecting a spider. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not scared of any insects, any animals. Are you not? You're not. So no. you would happily hold spiders? Nope. I would literally nope. can get a spider with a cup and a magazine, let it out the garden, let it run free. What about if you were to hold a tarantula? I reckon if I had to, I would be able to. I okay. obviously don't, wouldn't want to go and do it on my weekends. No. <laughs> but it's not a preferable yeah, activity. No, of course. Fine. But 
It's just I have I used to have a really bad fear with planes, but now I've realised it's not actually me being on the plane; it's me dying on the plane. I think a lot crash. of people would be scared of that, though. Yeah, yeah. And that's so, something I think about. So a lot. the thought of like going. Have you like, ever yeah. have you ever seen bridesmaids? Yeah. Are you that woman? There's a colonial woman on the wing. <laughs> she is churning butter. <laughs> no. Had a dream. You're in it. Suck right in the toilet. Suck right in. <laughs> <laughs> we all went down. You were in it. In yeah, I just said that. To be fair, I think I think that's quite common, isn't it? That's quite common. Yeah, well, I can't think of anything else. What, are you shooting down my fear now? No, I mean, <laughs> I'm trying to You're make you feel You're not allowed to feel that way. Actually. I, I not, hope you I know that. that. I'm trying yeah, to comfort common. you, Millie. Okay, good. Okay, yes, that is it. Well, Millie's yeah. biggest fear is being in grade three piano, because that is just like... <laughs> Gives her the shakes just thinking about it. Millie's fear <laughs> is being on GMT. <laughs> <laughs> Millie's fear is stringy fucking I'm fish shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot of fears. Um, Sam, what's your fear? Is that phobia? It's phobia and fear, the same thing, basically. Yeah, yeah. I think a phobia is a bit more like, a bit cool. more like, <laughs> A thing that you have a phobia of, a fear yeah, is you fear it. Like there are people out there with real phobias. Like, oh. and I, you know, we, we laugh, but people, no, I'm going to laugh. No, but do you know people, <laughs> no, people have, did you ever watch Maury? The Maury show. Maury. Maury Hi. show. The Maury show. That wasn't about fears and phobias. Yeah, because there's episodes in there where this woman was scared of like pickles and they get like jars of pickles and run after her and she's like screaming, running around the whole, and they yeah. chase her. Like people no, come out yeah, the yeah, cupboard yeah. like dressed with giant pickles. I think chase fears. Her. <laughs> Everyone has fears, <laughs> don't they? You have certain fears, but like I think a phobia, when you really have it's a phobia, phobia, is like. <coughs> so like, what's yours? I say I've got a phobia of spiders, but I don't because I'm just really scared of them. But I don't like. I can. So you fear spiders? Yeah. I can yeah. look at a spider. I can, you know, it, at a push like you said, get a glass and a magazine yeah. and take it away. Well, yeah. I do struggle. Fear it, but it's not a phobia. <laughs> so what's your phobia, homo? <laughs> <laughs> You're homophobic. Oh, I don't know. Like proper phobia. I think <laughs> this this one's real. I actually have a fear. No, a phobia. Mm. I know what no, you're gonna say. Fear. What? Someone chased up the stairs. <gasps> of what? Actually, yeah. I wasn't gonna say that, but oh. yeah. Of what? Phobia. I didn't even think Someone about that. So a like, I yeah. I have a fear of people chasing me up the stairs. No joke. Oh, that is scary though. That is quite no, scary. No, 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 but that's why I live in the daylight. Very common, no, no, no. Sam. Even in the daylight. <laughs> Are you trying to discredit my phobia, <laughs> Millie? Yeah, no, it's scary. Yeah, no, it is. And he, mm. honestly, if anyone, not like in a public space, I don't know why, like if it's in public or whatever, like if I'm walking up the escalators at Westfield, I ain't scared that someone's behind me. But you start screaming. It's at home. It's at home. When you turn the lights off downstairs, even... you've got to run up. Yeah, that is a bit. And, I don't, and do you know what? I specifically moved into a flat that don't have stairs because that's how scared I am. Well, that wasn't the reason we moved out because there's a wasp's nest literally attached oh, to our right. house. Yeah, we did move out because there was a big wasp's <laughs> nest. Sake. <laughs> no, your and old place was haunted though. By no, the, the old. Was. Anyway, but regardless, the stairs. Yeah. I don't like it when people chase me. He used to do it on purpose, where well, chase me up yeah, the stairs. Yeah, I did. So I did do that. Oh. And are you guys okay? Did you know the phobia at that point? Oh god, yeah. <laughs> I don't know why though. No, it's like the. It's like I hear the stomping That's behind me. I hear the stomping. It is scary. It's the noise of like because when I watched scary, the woman in it? black, don't even really. um, the scene where you look down, she's at the end of the corridor and goes doof 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 and gets closer. So that is that's awful. awful. I've got a fear of Love Island <laughs> winners. <laughs> Love Island winners. <laughs> We've got a whole therapist here right now. Yeah. Well, that's a lie. That was a lie. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm what's your, it. Oliver, what's your fear? <laughs> Sashrobia? I don't know. Oh, oh, you don't have one? No, I do, but I can't think of like, top of my head. Heights? Def no, I love heights. Defo dying on a plane. That yeah. would be scary. Um, you know what I don't like actually is when you're in the ocean and a big wave comes and you know when you get churned around <gasps> and the wave. Ooh. In Bali, the, was it the same in Thailand? Like, were the waves like really big? No. In Bali, they were like fucking huge. Wow. And we'd go out and like swim in them. But you know when that like the wave starts to break mm -hmm. and that's when like really <clears throat> slaps you. Like some of them were huge Slap and literally up. we'd go under and get swelled around oh, like a few like times. I love that. that. 
No, me, me and my brother. I, I was gonna that. die I when I, I went to die. Dominican Republic in July for my mum's birthday. Me and my brother, the the waves were like double the height. Probably if you stood up there, like where the ceiling is, right? They were huge, <gasps> and we'd like jump. We jump as it was crashing, like in the direction, and it literally, I, I cut my back because it slammed me against the seabed. What is fun oh. about that? Well, obviously that bit wasn't fun, but it's fun. <laughs> like if you ride the wave to like thingy, if you stay yeah, above the wave, if you that's ride what we were it, trying to do. But every now and then it goes. But boom. not if I'm doing not Beth Tweddle in the Olympics underneath the wave. I don't want to do that. Mm. I can't really think. I don't so do you have like God. a deep fear of the ocean then? To be fair, yeah. yeah. I was once, let me tell a short story. I was once swimming in Zante and I go. was like, I was petrified. I'm petrified of sharks. I'm like, there's no sharks. It's warm water. Sam's leaving. And <laughs> they were like, no, 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 there's no sharks, no sharks. So we went out with this guy, went swam for ages. And in Zante, like the sea's really shallow. So you can swim for ages before it gets like quite deep. And we were really far out. And then there were the, he was like, oh, if you go underwater, you'll be able to see the turtles. You can swim with them. And I was like, oh, that's amazing. And I was like, can they bite you? And bear in mind, I'm treading water. Like, got a turtle? Yeah, I was like, can they bite you? Because they're huge. They can, they've got snappers, haven't they? Yeah, and he was like, they wouldn't really bite humans, but if they mistake you for a fish, they could easily like rip off your leg. And I was with my friend in this like random Greek man. And literally, <laughs> like he said that they were still talking, and then she was like, "Oh, she was asked, calling my name," and she was like, "Oliver, like turning around," as she said, "Also, my head popping back to the shore because I was literally panicking. I was stressed. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> get me back because I thought, fuck that. Water I is can't. scary, isn't it? I think water actually, you've just like unlocked like a several fear. fears. Like of mine. if if I'm on a cruise and the, do you know when you see like videos of the waves going mental? No. They're like as high as like the Empire State Building. <gasps> And the sea is so dark. And do you know one thing that actually terrifies me is giant jellyfish. Sorry, I just opened my phone. <laughs> giant jellyfish. No. Yeah, look, look at this photo. Do you, know, do you know how big they go? No. They are bigger like they're bigger than double decker buses. They're like bigger than houses. But did you know they're not the wow. most dangerous? The most dangerous jellyfish is actually the tiny a Portuguese man of war, and that is a really small jellyfish. It's literally like that big. What, and they're really dangerous? A Portuguese man, no, it's not that it tiny. Can, it can kill you. Portuguese yeah, man of war is like go. blue. It looks like oh a balloon that floats that's on the disgusting. surface. That looks you sting, like a plant. Sting from that, Let's see. You. Look how big like they go. Like a massive seabed plant. That is disgusting. That's mental. But imagine getting like caught in its Ugh. tentacles. Imagine reincarnating and being that person. jellyfish. That would be Yeah, hell. that's the person next to also, it. Also, guys, <gasps> another fact about jellyfishes, they don't have brains. How do they even work? Look at the size of that. Sorry, that is disgusting. That's compared to a human. That's Photoshop. It's not Photoshop. To be. That ain't real. Imagine. That is the same size as my hemorrhoids. Literally looks like a I know. Double whammy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Imagine if you survive the plane crash and you land in the sea and you see that thing. Then you got killed by that. <laughs> That you survive the plane crash, but the jellyfish. Ate but that you. is the thing. Like you know, if a plane goes down and they have those stupid slides. Also, you know, in a plane when they say duck your head like that, mm -hmm. that is a thing because if you hit the surface if you go like that you die instantly Apparently whereas if you survive you can sue them but is that <gasps> true though i think it is because if you go like that your spine look mm -hmm. listen but who's lived to tell the tale no there have been plane crashes no, yeah people survive. survive there's one yeah, guy but someone done that and snapped their neck how would they know guy. but listen if you are going 500 <laughs> miles an hour into the side <laughs> of a mountain <laughs> going like that ain't gonna save your life no it's not i'd more go yeah, like this going like there i'd be like this like that <laughs> I do him fuck all. No, it's not. Especially it's in not the side of Kilimanjaro. And if the plane blows up, I'm sorry, that <laughs> it ain't doing fuck all for nah. you. Lad, no, but because as soon as you hit an impact, it just like breaks your spine and you're dead. Rock up your spine. Dead. <gasps> I'd rather that. Yeah. Than to be actually fair. like try and survive it. And then what if like what if uh what if no what if, what? What if you you're in a you're in a cool in a plane crash right lands and water. Everyone survives it, but your seatbelt's stuck. <gasps> oh my God. Imagine Why if you your seatbelt's stuck. Me? And then all the lights flicker and they go out and then the water just keeps rising. rising. And you're stuck, stuck and you're in the drown. Yeah. And oh. a jellyfish comes I would out. breathe right. in so I've hard to get out. I've decided I don't want to fly now. <laughs> but <laughs> I'll go to LA next week. <laughs> Be careful. Oh, shit, yeah. Talking about water, when I was a child, right, I this was all over the news, I don't even know why, and I was going on holiday at the time. Some boy, little boy, got sucked into a swimming pool. Yeah. And like, right. got like, oh God, this is so many years Oh, you ago. mean like the cleaner thing? Like a, the drain the pipe? The drain Filt thing. Off. And I now, when I'm in the pool, I will really <laughs> get away from that fucking drain. That <laughs> yeah, but now the drain, they're on the sides. They're never at the bottom anymore. No, they are still. Some of them have them. And 
he, he was all oh dark whatever i feel so awful that's about happened that, a few times and i'm fine it's happened to loads yeah. of people like I'm actually dying like it, that there's the suction of the pool so Drowned powerful you. it's just like you can't get out mm. i've well i used to be scared when my i used to go to spain on holiday and you know like the cover that you put over a pool mm. and yeah. like my mom and that would be like whatever you do i like, don't think it's funny to like run over that because if you go under then that covers over you there's yeah, a whole film true. about that. Have you, have you heard of it? What? There's like, they go in a pool. A and film? For, yeah, it's a yeah, film and they that. get stuck under the cover and they're there for like days because the pool is closed. Like it's probably a bank holiday. I think they're there overnight. That sounds like such oh. a boring film. No, but it's actually wild because oh, no. then like someone, like a cleaner comes in and then she like portrays them eventually, doesn't she? Mm. And she turns the heating in the pool off. So they're like trying to survive, but it's like fucking freezing. Have you seen that film? Imagine. That film, that reminds me of that film. Um, what's it called? 47 meters deep or whatever. Yeah. I want the one where the, the massive shark. The one where they go the shark diving. I will never ever do a shark cage. But Fuck then the thing thriller. comes off no and the whole cage goes all the way to the bottom. There is no way in hell I'm doing though. a shark cage. I feel like cage. I'd have to experience it. Yeah, same. But what about do shark cage? Yeah, I'm not going to do it, but I want to do it. Would you do, do skydiving? Yes. Mm. But I do what? Would you do skydiving? Or have you done skydiving? No. No, neither would I. Wouldn't would you ever do it? Do it? No. Never. No, I would never. Would you prefer to, to bungee jump or skydive? For me, skydive. Bungee jump. Bungee jump. Because bungee jump, you fall on your own. Skydive, you got someone on your but back. But you know that oh, you're attached true. to something. If that parachute ain't coming Yeah, but what off, if the bungee fun, jump snaps? Yeah, but did you not see Pinker at all? And, her bungee and you're on your own. Because with bungee jumps, so you go down, you go all the way back up. You go down, you go all the way down. And then you have to like steady and then you get dragged all the way back up. No, not yet. But what about the ones that like go in the water and literally their whole fucking body gets oh, like the doused jump in, in the water and then them. they get pulled back up? I wouldn't do that. No, no. I think I would do a bungee jump. I wouldn't <laughs> jump out of a plane. I, no. I physically don't think I could jump off. I, I couldn't yeah. go off the edge of a bungee jump. Whereas if someone's on the back of me, sure, because they just they Pretty just shuffle sure. forwards and you go. But that's the only way I could do it because I could I could not bring myself to jump off. 300 meters so up in the true. air, the platform. Like push me. Because you can't hold on to anything. You literally <gasps> just free fall down until you get caught oh, by yeah, the you're spring. Right. Maybe Have I you, do it. you know, Fiona? Fiona Kennedy. Our yeah, a lovely Fiona. Our friend did a bungee jump, right? When I tell you, she jumped off that. Literally, her back went. Like she just won the lottery. She went. <laughs> she did proper, like, she went for it. Really? Fair play for like, that is yeah, that's like adrenaline, like. Yeah, Fiona, I can yeah. imagine Fiona's yeah. a bit of a junkie for that. Yeah, yeah. Junkie. I watched that and I thought, fair play. Yeah, fair play. Mm. Yeah, but what I feel like we all say it would be scary, but then in the moment, I think you it feel would amazing. feel unreal. Yeah, yeah. Imagine like the rush you get when you know yeah. you're safe. <gasps> yeah. That must and be you incredible. Survived, yeah. yeah, when you get pulled back up. Yeah. not on the way I down. I wonder how many people oh, die from bungee jumps. Oh, no. How many people oh, die from go. bungee jumps? <gasps> Don't what. Here we go. This is what's making us have fears and phobias. We don't need to know the statistics. We there were 18 recorded deaths wow. last month. What? Oh. No, I'm joking. Um, there was like 18. <laughs> I was going to say, that's a lot. There was 18 recorded deaths between 1986 and 2002. Oh. In more recent years, there have been five bungee jump fatalities Ooh. between 2015 and 2018. Whoa. I'd be it's that a, unlucky cunt. It's a right. one in 500,000 yeah. chance of a fatality. Cool, you Look, if you're meant one. to go, you're meant to go, one. but I just don't think bungee jumping should be that dangerous. Surely not. I would love to skydive though. I don't know. It would be fun. I, I did look and to. you can do like what? 10,000 feet and 15,000 feet. Oh, can you? Yeah, you can do different ones. You seen those yeah. people that jump from space? Drop from space? Jump from space. Jump from space. You've seen jumping from space. Not many people space. do it though, because you can set on fire on the what? way down. Have you seen jumping from space? No. <laughs> Central Sea did it. They send oh, this massive it. helium balloon Amanda Holden up it. into the atmosphere, <laughs> right? And you, they have to wear the proper helmet, everything, like, because you can't breathe up there. And then they just go. That's just weird. Why and th would and you then want jump to do off. That? From the atmosphere, and you're on your own. You go what if they got the up there and was like, on your own? Yeah, you're and on you're your just own. The platform the whole it way just up. Seems you're on to your be own. Quite not a fun experience to do. No, that's just weird. Just I'd rather sit and do a podcast, but yeah. everyone likes their own things. What don't actually? They? Next week's podcast is going to be filmed from the atmosphere, guys. So tune in for next week. <laughs> 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 well, I think my fear slash phobia is heights. But say if I'm at a height where 
there's if I'm at the top of the shard or whatever, yeah, yeah. I'm not scared because there's a glass in the way. I do but feel weird I, up there. If though. I was yeah. on that height with just a railing, God, no. I could never go near. The, I'd, my legs would honestly tremble. Mm. No, no, I'm a celebrity this year when they had to walk out on that platform and then lean forwards. I can't. I wouldn't be able to do it. Yeah, my but legs they're would harness, just, yeah, but they're so harness. I feel like you'd be like. You tell me you could just do that. The wind is blowing you like that, I, and at I the end could. you had to jump I off. I know I could do. That. In order, oh, is that yeah. off the in order to get, you had to jump off in order to collect the star. But you fuck are you that. are on a harness, and you're not like jumping all the way like bungee jump. And you could sue a little bit. I would shut. And also like big spiders, I can't do that. Yeah, can't do that. Can't do it. I've got a bit of a fear of like playground areas. Expand. What about what about them swings? I had this really horrible nightmare once that I got kidnapped in a playground area, and now I cannot look at them because it really freaks me out. Really? Was it that vivid? Re like I, I had it twice. Oh. I had the same nightmare twice. Reoccurring. And my aunt, it was me, and my sister, on my auntie. Me and my sister was in this play area in a bank, and my auntie was getting money out. And then while she was getting money out, this guy was just standing. The, the like playground area, like crawling through the balls, just trying to get us. And uh, honestly, I had it twice. And uh, now when I look at a playground area, it freaks me out. Like, you know, the indoor ones, not outdoor. Oh, oh an indoor, indoor one. play oh. area. Oh. Like, indoor play area. What, like the ones that used to like get Tim at McDonald's Buck before? That's a demon. <laughs> That's a demon. That's Did you ever go to a McDonald's with a play that? area? Yeah. yeah. You remember that McDonald's with a play area? That is quite that's scary. Yeah. Isn't it scary when you think about it? Scary, yeah. and now it just freaks me out. Yeah. To be that. fair, I think when you have a bad dream, that you know, that's enough to put you off anything. Yeah. You know what does scare me about outdoor players? If it's dark and it's windy and the swing is going like that, because Ugh. you know, in Harry Potter, <gasps> Prisoner of Azkaban, when that happens, they're coming. That's fucked me up since the Dementors are literally they're like. Oh, <laughs> <God>. <laughs> Sucking life out oh, of me. Wow, oh, that was good. That's quite You're good now a dementia. Yeah. You suck I'm the life out of everyone. <laughs> voice <laughs> Get voice me on the over artist <laughs> over here. Wow. But yeah. Oh God. Well, guys, I feel a bit scared now. <laughs> yeah, I feel like we need to play like we need to play out like a funny, uplifting game. Yeah, we I've do. Just wet yeah, let's but change the tone. You need to you need to watch that on a different platform. <gasps> Yeah, sorry guys. Different platform. Actually, you yeah, need to watch this isn't that. for yeah, just yeah, yeah, yeah. the general people. This oh, is for the special guys who come. We're gonna play gonna Smash play. or Pass. Yeah, I think it's like maybe. Yeah. Five we're not gonna play Five it here. Day. We're gonna tease you. Right. Yeah, we're gonna play Smash or Pass. We're gonna do some raunchy things. Mm. Mm. Right. <laughs> <laughs> we're going over to OnlyFans with Millie. We are. Ooh, so everyone, out. thank you so much for watching, and thank you so much, Millie, for coming on. Thanks. Thanks. And don't forget, baby. If in doubt, yeah. do your piano lessons and watch GMTV. <laughs> <laughs> and GMTV. And GMTV. But yeah, thanks so much. Bye. Bye.